nice. Right. Where are we? Hello, welcome to the channel. Right, we're late, so I need to get moving. Just messing about. Uh, that's where we were. Uh, now, how's the time doing? Oh, look at this. What's going on here? Um, it's 10 o'clock. 10. It's 10. It's 10 o'clock. It's 10. Um, it's 10! Blah, 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 blah. Getting hassle for the parking guy. Um, getting hassle for the parking guy. I might, must remember to take a, a good old grip of this thing. Uh, don't know what was going on there. Probably variety, variety bar. Glasgow's. Oh, it, it is going downhill. I mean, is it? Isn't it? Was it not? Is it my imagination? Uh, I'd say it was going downhill. Aye. Uh, definitely. So it's 10 o'clock. So I'm starting to get a little bit despondent about everything. What's life all about? Is it just sitting around drinking coffee? Aye, it is. I like to have a bit of a wander around in between that and the big breakfasts. I've had a well, this one's breakfast, I won't need any food now. Hey. I won't need anything. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, we're getting done over by the globalists. That's why our flag's getting... <sighs> Used in... Named in vain. Named in vain is what it is. Look at that up there. What's this? Oh, it's that van that's doing that. Safety supplies. I'm gonna get the clean air zone any minute now. Oh no, we're in it, we're in it already. I didn't notice the breathing was much better. Breathing in bullshit. And we're off. The BMW makes a run for it. How are you going to go over here without being killed? I don't know. I don't see any button. There's a, there's a button there. Uh, right, let's go. Oh, it says green anyway. Uh, there's a big truck. Uh, and let's pop over. It's the motorway. Right there. Yes. So this is a clean air zone. The clean air is here, or the clean air here, and what the government has done is keep all the dirty air. Dirty air's down there. It's really clever, actually. 
So all the dirty air coming out of that bus, it stays down there, the clean air up here stays up here. I mean, that's how these politicians get paid such a lot of money. So that is really intelligent, you know? They work stuff like that out. I mean, you're like normal people like me can't, would never think of that. Uh, we're all dumb. So, that's how they do it. These fucking politicians. The assholes. So there we go, there's there. Yes. Now we've got a green light. Go, go, go. Go. There's the toilet that's going to fall down. They will never fix that. They will never fix that. Remember, a lot of the politicians and that, a lot of them are just in it for their pensions. And um, not only that, um, they are also um, in it for, a lot of them are lefties as well. So if they're lefties, they'll go, hang, see like the Christie clock in Stirling? Um, you know, there is a kind of element of it, oh fuck it, it was built by some guy that was in the Masons, or something like that, or what, some white guy, you know. So, we'll just fucking knock it down, you know? We'll just knock it down. in Sakhi Hard Street in Glasgow and this toilet is falling down and the council do bog all about it despite all the money they're getting off people for ripping them off with their clean air zones which is fake scam 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 demic nonsense scamaholics they can't stay away from people robbing people blind and then they cut the, but the town's still a shithole anyway I'm not doing very well here but I'm so angry that's why I'm that's why I'm blustering my words. Here we are. It'll never get fixed. It's on the lead. It's a bit like this. Like that. Thanks for watching. Oh. What the hell's that? Paint. I can stood on paint. I stood on paint. Um so on the yeah, so they'll never fix that because it's and the thing about heritage and everything, you've got a sort of weird thing that took over. When did it actually happen? Well, I, I sort of got involved with it slightly in my own little way. I mean, why did you know to go into that? It's a bit difficult right, to explain how that came about. Yesterday, I was so for example trying to explain it. That's not explaining it, but... So I'm against Scottish nationalism, right? And... Scottish Greens. I don't... I'm against net zero. All that nonsense. Right. So yesterday... So I'm on this... I watched this page on Facebook. It's called Swinney Out or something. That's John Swinney. First Minister. So-called. And... Um, so they, they were talking about this trans woman who was a Scottish Green, I forget her name, Molly something or... I, I can't actually remember. And, you know, so they've been really like horrible about, about her, right? Let's, well, I'll call her a her, you can call her whatever you like, but I think she's a her. Um, so it's kind of like, um, what? Wow, a BMW. <laughs> it's getting charged. Um, so, that idiotic man. Because he's got. See, I can bring my Granada in here. My Granada's cheaper than the. Yeah, but I'll get. 
it'll be his accountants telling him to get an electric car, a Jaguar, and a BMW. His accountants of Tell your accountant to get to fuck. I mean, okay. It's all a big scam, isn't it? Right, anyway, so where were you? Right, so this lady is a Scottish Green, and it tends to be that your LGBT people and your trans and all that sort of type people are tending to be involved with well, the Greens or like, like the SNP. Uh, that's just a sort of the reality is, if, if you did like statistical analysis, you know, they're all in, and that, why? Well, why is that? Well, it's because they feel that they're going to get something. They're part of some kind of movement. Um, they're going to support their right to be who they are, whatever it is. I know when you really, really dissect what they say, it's all very... Um, Iffy, to say the least. Um, <coughs> the theory behind it, and uh, um, it's an ideology, basically. So I got involved with them with that uh, for a why? Well, hmm, it's difficult to really say why. I mean, it's probably because I was disaffected. What's that word mean? Uh, disenfranchised? I was a disenfranchised male. I'd been dumped by the woman that I, that I was that I'd married, uh, by my mother, my sister, females. Toxic females. Uh, well, I was related to them, or I was... Um, which way do you want to go? This one. I was related to them, or I was... I married them. But obviously that's why the disenfranchised are... It's, um, falsely empowered. Also, I, I can't actually remember the full ins and outs of the psychological aspect of this. Um, but basically, the, the narcissist, which isn't me, so I would have been... Under the, the, it's like a jigsaw where one bit fits in the other bit. So you gotta ask yourself, why did the women that I, why did they marry me? You know, why did what did they see in me? You know, and it's like what they would say. Well, they have said, oh, we didn't know this or that or the other, but they did because they've always got that cover. Where they can feign innocence. But anyway. So I went, I had all these mental problems and I don't know if I'm really explaining, am I really explaining this? I think I am, for those of you, are not. When we'll get back to the actual bigger picture with the, um, a, why do men land up, well we'll just say men at the moment, um, that ain't it. Um, becoming part of these ideologies and these groups, you know, um, the LGBT and the trans stuff and all that stuff. Why? Why do they get into that? And you know, it's it's really because they're disenfranchised. So they're trying to be franchised. So they're trying to open up their own orthodoxy. Uh, is that electric? Uh, it must be. They, they open up their own orthodoxy, or try to establish their own orthodoxy, which is the LGBT or the trans community. So, what I'm saying is, we'll have battles within minorities. Like J.K. Rowling. Well, she's a woman. She's a nasty woman. Right, now, so back to it. What this guy said was, that that lady, the Green, it, the lady that started to be an MP, Scottish Greens, was calling J.K. Rowling a sour-faced cow. Well, she is. So I went and said that. Then I went and complained about 
So this is probably because of my thing, but I still am against the SAP, I'm against the Greens, against Net Zero, against uncontrolled immigration, you know, against all the things that they're all for. Uh, but I'm in the sort of weird situation where, wow, look at that. Um, it's a, a paradox for me, really, but it, it shouldn't be. You should be able to have your own beliefs and opinions. Anyway, so I don't know if I really like That's probably made it even worse, so the description is pretty shit, really. So, the wheelie bin. <laughs> right, thanks for watching. Bye!